Well, how are we doing out there? I hope you're all spot on. Thanks for watching the video. Now I've been shopping. I've been to Tesco. Come and have a look what I've got. I was having a little walk around Tesco as you do and I came across this and I noticed that it was new. Tesco finest. Slow cooked Cockuvin. Cockuvan. I think it's pronounced. I may be wrong. Chicken legs with a Merlot wine, onions, mushrooms and bacon lardons served with a red wine and red currant sauce. Oven cook 35 minutes. British chicken. Slow cooked for two and a half hours to lock in flavour. Serves two. Little traffic light system there look suitable for freezing and there is the serving suggestion. Now I got this on a club card deal. The original price is six fifty. I got it for five pounds, and I thought I've I, I don't I don't think I've had it. I really don't. I might have had it years and years ago, but it's a French classic, isn't it? Cocu van, Cocu van. <laughs> it's a strange old name, isn't it? Um, and it did look good and it's new, so I have to try it, I really do. So let's have a look at the box. I went to France in summer as well. Um, I didn't I didn't have this though, I had the old frog's legs and um, snails. Escargot. Um, but I didn't have this, But let's, so let's have a look. 775 grams, little BG sticker there with a cord. There is some nutritional information if you want to pause that and have a look at that. By all means, go ahead. And they are the ingredients. There, look. A um, few allergens. We've got sulfites, milk, sulfites. Yeah, not, not particularly good, are they, the old sulfites, I'll be honest. Chicken legs, 54%. You know, you don't want to be seeing the old sulfites in anything, do you, really? Let's be honest. Unfortunately, it is in food, isn't it? A little bit of spiel about it there. Look, slow cooked chicken legs in a red wine sauce with onions, mushrooms and bacon lardons and a sachet of red wine. Beef stock and red currant sauce. There are the cooking instructions. Do it in the oven. That's where mine's going in the oven. 200 degrees, fan 180, gas 6 for 35 minutes. Um, before I um, open it, I will just read there's a little important message here. Not suitable for cooking from frozen, it says. I thought I'd just mention that. So let's get this open. I'll just move you up a bit. How's that? Um, is there a tab system? No, there's not. We've just got to open it and try not to destroy the box. So it's not frozen, it's fresh. There it is, look. There's your cock van. Um, and then you, there's your sauce, look. Your red wine gravy. I'm going to put that to one side. Because there is a little bit of a, a procedure, um, if you want to read it. I will read it and save you that. Or you can pause it. Made using British chicken and British and EU pork. So we have to transfer this to an oven proof dish, which I have got there now. There is no tab system to open it, you will need some scissors. So that, that well, it doesn't, I mean, let, it, it doesn't look great like that, does it? It really doesn't, but I'm sure it will, I'm sure when it's cooked it will, it'll look a lot better than that. I'm going to try and separate it, if I can, and turn them that way around. I want them, that's it, like that. Oh, this is posh for me. <laughs> look at that. It doesn't look particularly good like that, does it? Let's be honest, it, it doesn't. But we're going to cook it now. We're going to put it in the oven. Centre of the oven. 25 minutes. 180. Fan. The cocku van has had 25 minutes in the oven. Now I've got to drain the juice and put it back in for another 10 minutes. So I'm going to do that right now. I can't find my sieve. I can't find my sieve, so I'm gonna to have to use this this thing here, this colander I think it's called. So you gotta take these out, put them on this 
plate here and then you need to drain the juice out oh no that's not going all over drain that juice out you've got to keep that juice as well and retain it doesn't matter does it put them back in there put them back in as well stick them on top give me hands a wash put that back in the oven for a further 10 minutes got some new plates the other ones were chipped and added so we've got some new ones got these for, not sponsored by anyone whatsoever but we got these from Matalan Matalan yeah I think they were about eight and a half quid, nine quid, something like that, in the sale. What you've got to do now, you make your gravy. There is your gravy, look. So that's going in there. I've just had a look for a tab system and I can't find one. Oh, hang on a minute, there's one there. Let's see if this works. My hands are a bit wet. Yes, it does work. So you put the put your gravy in the pot like that. Turn it on. I'm just going to put it on low, just a low heat. Make sure I get all that gravy out. And what you what you're supposed to do as well is with your juice that you drained off, you to retain two or three tablespoons to go in your gravy. So that's what I'm going to do now. I'm just going to that'll do. You can put it all in if you want, but um, I'm just going as what it says, as the instructions. And then I'm just going to give it a stir, sort of stir it in. I'll bring you down and show you lovely people out there. Look at that, rich red wine gravy. So I'm just going to get that up to temperature and let it bubble away and thicken up, hopefully, while the chicken is in the oven for 10 minutes. My cocku van is ready. I'm going to get it out now. And well, uh, what it is, I've got some, I'm going to leave some there. I'm just going to plate up one lot. I'm going to leave some in there for my good lady. She'll be coming through the door anytime. Anytime soon. Um, what we've got as well, we've got some, we did a roast yesterday and I've got some leftover roast potatoes. And I did a comparison between Yorkshire puddings, so I've got a few of these as well left over. So I'm going to plate this up now. Um, these plates are absolutely massive as well. <laughs> and I've got some veg as well, I'm going healthy with some vegetables. What's going on? Um, and we'll put a Yorkshire pudding on there, uh, a couple of Yorkshires on there as well, look. Wowzers. This is healthy. Now my sauce. I'll go and get that now. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna nap it over. I've heard that word on the old television, the old nap. I'm gonna just throw it over the the skin, because I do like the skin as well, that's gonna get eaten. And it has reduced down this sauce. So I won't use it all, I'll save me my good lady some. We've got stuffing as well. There's the sauce in there. There it is, have a look at that, see what you think. It's looking good, isn't it? Can't wait to try it. That's what I'm going to do now. There's your lardons. Your sauce. Oh, let's, let's, let's just get that. Oh, look at that. Oh, ho, 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 that looks good, doesn't it? I'll bring you down to my level. Have a look at that. Oh, I can't wait to try this. I really can't. Let's get in there. It's lovely and tender as well. Let's get in there with that juice. That gravy. Let's try everything. Goku van. <laughs> Saying it all wrong, probably. Have a look in there. <laughs> oh, dropping it. 
So if you like this kind of video, please give it a thumbs up. Maybe consider subscribing to the channel. Let me know your thoughts on the old, um, old cocky van. There it is. Mm. Oh, that gravy is good. Oh, it is. It's so good. It's well seasoned as well. You've got the lardons there, look. Mm. Oh, that is good. I've had something similar to this, but not this, I don't think. And I was expecting that flavour of the to come through of that gravy, and it has as well. It's come right through. Look at that. Oh, it's so good. Let's get these York, these um, roast potatoes in as well. Just popped them in the oven. That gravy's that gravy's reduced down as well. Oh, that's a big mouthful, isn't it? I'll tell you what, I'll leave the roasties off. The chicken is lovely and moist as well. Tender. That gravy is well seasoned. It's quite sweet. But it's packing a punch. It's packing a real flavour. It, it is. Mm. Now I know you can make your own. You really can. But these are available in our supermarkets. Mm. And they're on a club card deal. I know that I know the five pounds. I like the skin as well. That's the skin is so good. Nothing's getting nothing's going to waste. I'll pick that I'll pick that leg clean. It'll be like a piranha. <laughs> Nothing gets wasted. Mmm. So much flavour in the skin. It is good. It really is good. I've reduced the gravy down so I've made it thicker and more intense. And it, it does... It, for me, I that, that, that makes it really... It's just getting that gravy to the sort of... The, the sort of velvety thickness that you, you know, you like. It's good. I like it. I do like it. Yeah. I do like it. It's a treat, isn't it? It is a treat. So thanks very much for watching. I do appreciate it. I'm going to get into this now. My good lady will be coming through the door any second and I'll plate her dinner up. So thanks very much for watching. Thanks for joining the membership as well. Take care. All the best. I'll catch you on the next one.